Hi everyone, my name is Andrei Kozarev and today I would like to tell you about Cockpilot. It's an LLM-based code generation plugin for the Cock programming language. We have been working on this project in team with Gleb Solovyov, Nikita Hramov and Anton Podkapayev at the Programming Languages and Program Analysis Lab at JetBrains Research. Thanks to OpenAI, Microsoft and other big tech companies, powerful code generation became accessible to millions of users. Now even user not familiar with technology can try to write code using an AI assistant. But will this generated code be reliable and trustworthy? There are studies that show two things. First, people who use AI assistants tend to introduce more bugs and vulnerabilities into software than people who write code on their own. Second, people using AI assistants are usually more confident about their code being more secure than the latter. If you think for a moment, we realize that when the complexity of our request to an LLM grows, chances of us bumping into problems arise. First of all, we are not always dealing with code we already know. Also, sometimes testing a function may not be sufficient enough. And lastly, playing English is usually a bad choice as a language for specification, as it's hard to check an implementation against a non-formally structured description. Is there a way to generate code using LLMs more reliably? We believe yes. We can use a formal language called Coq to write the specification. Let me briefly explain you how can it solve most of our problems. Let's take a look at the way we define the sorting function in Coq. By its semantics, it's something that takes a list as an input and returns a sorted permutation of this list uh, as an output. The return type here actually says that exists such L prime so that it's the permutation of the input and is sorted. Coq based uh, on the Harry Howard isomorphism and uh, therefore writing proofs uh, for theorems in Coq coincides with writing programs. When we finish the proof of the sort theorem, we can extract a sorting algorithm. Another important property is that using Coq's system, we can automatically check if the given proof correctly solved the problem. Proofs in Coq are constructed from so-called tactics, and when applied, tactics change the state of the current proof. For example, one can apply induction reasoning. Tactic induction takes uh, the current statement and introduces two new goals, one assuming the base of induction and the other the induction step. Let's notice that Coq is very suitable for code generation. Code could be automatically checked, and Coq has a special tactic called admit, allowing to temporarily leave a part of a proof unfinished and move with other parts. It works like leaving a blank space in the function implementation. You sketch the proof and request generation for the self-contained small parts later on. These leftover holes in the proofs are independent from one another and could be substituted in parallel. We propose Cockpilot, a plugin for substituting these leftover admits automatically. Cockpilot analyzes a file where it was run and collects useful information. For example, uses already proven theorems as a few short prompt. Along with that, uh, it takes the state of the proof at the admit and creates an auxiliary lemma from the hypothesis and the conclusion. This information is combined and sent to a bunch of services which can generate completions. We aim to make Copilot work as a conveyor of multiple generation methods to boost characteristics. At the moment, we support completion from LLM providers such as OpenAI, Brains AI platform and LM Studio. Apart from that, tools such as Cockhammer and Tactician that are invocated using a special tactic could be also used from Cockpilot. Cockpilot combines them and LLM services into a single pipeline and uh, potential proof candidates are gathered and sent to a wrapped instance of a Cock language server to check. Some proofs contain errors and get rejected, but when a valid proof is found, it's substituted into the user's UI. Finally, let's take a look at the process of admit substitution in action. Here in the video, I start the generation by selecting a batch of admits and running Cockpilot. All the parameters such as chosen services, prompts, temperatures, numbers of choices and API keys are already configured in the settings of my VS Code. In the bottom panel, you can see the spinning wheel indicating that work is in progress. Admits are starting to fill up.
After some time, all the unproved holes are now substituted and I can change the admitted in the end to a defined and conclude the proof. As was told before, we can extract a sorting algorithm from this theorem and apply it to a sequence. On the right, we see that the sequence becomes sorted. And that was it. Thank you all very much for your attention and we hope that this presentation has left you excited.